in it. And cut. Fine. And, and everything. Good afternoon my beautiful people. Hope all is well and if not all, most things are. It's rainy outside where I'm at. If it's rainy where you at, please be safe while driving on the road and if you're home, stay tuned to this channel cause what? We're going to be making some colored green Jamaican style mixed with bok choy. In Jamaica we have kalalu. I never had colored green in Jamaica. I've never seen it before. I don't know if it's there but I've just never had it in Jamaica before. It's when I reach the state I first eat colored green and many people might say what is colored green colored green is a vegetable a leafy vegetable just like kalalu but the thing is with colored green the texture of the, the vegetable is more thicker than kalalu and we have bok choy here lovely bok choy I saw it in the supermarket I could have passed it I just couldn't have passed it yeah and the thing about colored green and um, bok choy what I want to share with you guys um they both contain a lot of vitamins, high in vitamin A, vitamin C, calcium and potassium. Colored green has more pathogenic acid. Colored green is an excellent source of vitamins K and dietary fiber. Yes, you heard that. A lot of vitamins. It's, it's beneficial to your health. So you guys should definitely have some colored green and some bok choy every now and then you understand me so let's get this show start um i'm going to be showing you guys what kind of ingredients you are going to be needed to make this dish take a look on my board and see what's going on so as you see um i got um scotch bonnet pepper here a mixture of green yellow and red bell pepper i got butter here garlic over there scallion cut and um, tomato and I have onion right here um, you can add salt to it if you want I'm not gonna add salt in this dish um, this is gonna be a salt free dish and over here I have some black pepper that's all I'm going to be um, using in this dish so like I said if you want you can add salt to it I'm not gonna add any salt to this dish so let me get my um, colored green cut clean up and cut with my bok choy bok choy then I um, get back to you guys so when cutting up your collard green you can either um, cut the, the, the thick part out of the middle set it aside fold the leaf fold it like this and cut fine And then you can cut up this separate, cut it up fine, so it's easy to cook. Like that. Or if you want, you don't have to take the vein out. If you are strong enough, you can just fold it with the vein in it and everything. Just fold it, fold it with it in it and just cut everything together. I like to put a long cut between it so it's you know it's not stringy stringy but it does more um, short and you know easy to eat to me <laughs> when it's cooked you understand me so uh, with the bok choy you don't have to do much to cut it up because it's soft you know you just cut you can cut them even big because they're not tough they're easy to cook so it doesn't even matter how you cut them you know even like this they're soft and easy to cook same way so as you can see my vegetables are cut up and ready to go this is my colored green this right here is my bok choy and this is my um, onion bell pepper scallion garlic everything together in this in this um, dish right here so let's get this thing started in my pot right here is some canola oil with um, avocado oil so uh, what I'm going to be doing now is, let me test my pot if it's hot, as you can see it's hot, so I'm going to be adding in my um, bell pepper mixture with onion, garlic, pepper, skelly and, and everything. So let's add that in.
Mm. You put down and smell what's going on. And all of these um, seasoning come together and just kick up like, ooh, that's love. Mm. That's love. That's love, right? So let's add my um, collard green because the collard green is more um, a thicker steak, um, um, texture than the bok choy. So I'm going to be adding the collard green first. This smells so good. This smells so nice. Mm. Ooh. This smells so good. Yeah, I'm, and I'm going to be having this with some white rice. You know. So let's add my um, bok choy now. Then I'm gonna cut my border up in it. And guys, this butter that I just added, it's um, plant-based butter, all plant-based butter. So you can see my thing coming together. So I'm going to add some black pepper to this and just cover it down and let it steam for like about... Um, 10 to 15 minutes. Oh, this leaf is too big. Let's get it out. Don't want it in there. Yeah, so. I need some black pepper now. Not a lot. I don't want it to be too spicy because I already have um, scotch bonnet pepper in it. So. Oh, this is beautiful. This is just beautiful. Colored green. Jamaican style with bok choy. Oh, this is beautiful. This is. Whew. You could only smell what's going on here. Yeah, so I'm gonna just let this simmer down for at least uh, 10 to 15 minutes. Or even 10 minutes should be good. And get back to it. Alright, let's check on this and see what's going on. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. Mm. In Jamaica, when we're cooking color load, this is the same way we cook the color load. That is why I said I'm cooking the colored green, Jamaican style. You know, you saute your seasoning for a minute, your onion, bell pepper, tomato, and so forth. And then you add your color load, add your butter to it, add salt if you want. If not, you don't have to put no salt in it, just like I did with this, with, with, um, this dish. And this is ready. This is ready right now, you know, this is ready because you can look, you can see that the bok choy color changed from that um, bright white that it had to this um, a different color. Yeah, it's ready. Ready, 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 you know. So I'm just going to turn this off now and dish this out. And there you go, guys. This is how you make your colored green jamaican style with bok chow and white rice beautiful right look at that Ooh. look at that Ooh. i know you wish you would be having some of this right now mm, mm, mm. Mm. so thank you guys for joining me 
on this journey of making my colored green Jamaican style with bok choy you guys can watch this video and try to make your own and I'll catch you guys in another video bye stay safe peace and love